Okay. So I was looking into something uh, very interesting, uh, or I should say very absurd, but uh, I was kind of uh, trying to see uh, subjectively what exactly do I call happy and what do, what exactly I call suffering uh, for myself, right? And uh, what I'm finding is pretty interesting. It's um, if if I have to put it in the words, it would be more like um, you know. When I experience positive thought or positive emotions, positive thoughts and positive emotions, uh, that is what I call happiness. And when I experience negative thought and negative emotion, uh, that thing I call uh, uh, suffering, right? And it, it sounds so easy, right? It sounds so simple, but it's uh, very absurd how this uh, system is working inside myself, right? So, for example, uh, let's say an event happened, right? Something happened externally, right? Uh, maybe somebody saw, um, maybe somebody saw me walking, and maybe he came and he say, um, "You have a nice shirt. You're wearing the nice shirt." He praised me in some ways, right? Or maybe some somebody commented on this video and say, "Like, wow, you made a, such a nice video." Whatever it is, right? Somebody praised me. Or somebody said something good about myself, right? That external event that external event triggered an internal state of mind right what happens is i didn't do it i didn't intentionally thought about it or i didn't intentionally created these emotions but what happens is automatically i felt uh, you know um, such a rush of energy so lightness in the body my energy is moving up uh, the, the, the kind of heart is opening and my thoughts are like such a positive like I'm so smart and whatever, blah, blah, blah. It's like uh, this whole experience is being created inter inside of me, right? And that experience is somehow pleasurable, right? And that experience somehow is pleasurable. And this is what I'm calling happiness, right? This is what I'm calling, uh, you know, uh, happiness basically, right? On the other hand, something else happened, something opposite happened, right? Somebody saw me, it's like, you don't even have a proper camera, you don't even, you know, like many different things, he criticized me, or uh, or maybe I'm seeing somebody walks in front of me, uh, driving maybe some very fancy car, some something like, uh, maybe some Mercedes or something, right? And all of a sudden, inside myself, a whole different experience has been created automatically again, right? I didn't create it. But let's say I, this time I felt jealousy, right? My heart is like, mm. <laughs> it's like, you know, contracting and then um, my body is like getting stiff and my emotions are like, uh, you know, uh, so what's the big deal? I'm better in this, I'm better in that. So that experience, that internal state of experience in terms of thoughts and emotion, and let me be very clear what I mean by thoughts and emotion. Emotion is very clearly like, uh, physical sensations right your body feels different your body feels light your body feels you know uh, ju just feel light and feathery right and uh, and they, and then there is this upward movement of you know your heart is kind of opening up and then there's this uh, you know your energy i don't know how to say it but it's like physical experience and then the thought is thought is like a clear voice, right? It's like almost like I'm talking to you. It's like my head, something inside me is talking to me, right? And saying different, different things, right? And that combination of thought and emotion is what I'm calling happiness and sadness. And even more interesting thing than that is, right? Uh, there's even more subtle uh, reaction that is happening, right? Everything, every time I find something pleasurable uh, in terms of thoughts and emotion and something... Uh, unpleasurable in term, terms of thoughts and emotion, there is this, uh, uh, there is this uh, attachment, attachment, there's like another reaction happens inside you and that reaction gives even more force to these thoughts and emotions, right? So, uh, if somebody is praising me, somebody is saying good thing about me, the automatic thoughts and emotion comes like uh, all the good things and all this and then there's something internally which is even pushing it further, right? There's a force, It's all. it also has a nature, right? You can clearly see it also has a form, right? And that even pushed it further. So now these thoughts and emotion is even moving 
for longer time right then this keep go going 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 um, and in the in the in the in the presence of the other combination of thoughts and emotion which is like negative thoughts and emotions uh, still there is another you know internal reaction that is ha that happens but this time it's more like uh, um, aversion you can say these words attachment and aversion but they are more like you know a physical uh, forces they're almost like a force almost like you know magnet you know almost like a, a magnet is you know that kind of force it's clearly a physical force so this time it's more like a pushing away kind of force right and this again keeps that uh, you know you thoughts and emotion and that stream continues right the stronger the emotion the stronger that um, internal reaction is the stronger that subtle reaction is the longer this uh, process continues right and this is so absurd this is actually very stupid but that's how that's what uh, you know let's say now there's no event is happening outside but then these events that i that i have reacted to or that some reaction happens that more subtle reaction happens are now coming by themselves right and then they create even more reaction action reaction right so they just continues uh, this process for long 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 time right and i have like tons of these things keep coming inside me see so i think the point i want to make is uh, this is driving my actions these things uh, are my natural and default strategy is basically to maximize you know <laughs> the positive emotions and thoughts and you know uh, to minimize the negative emotions and thought an interesting thing is this default uh, strategy does exactly opposite right <laughs> because <laughs> uh, the negative thoughts and emotion continues to you know grow on the other hand positive thoughts and emotions are rather small but that's that's what happens naturally right that's what happened that's what is happening naturally and this is uh, uh, really stupid actually that yeah? this is very uh, weird but uh, yeah yeah so that's um, uh, i find it very interesting like this is happening and it kind of happens automatically right you don't do it you don't um, it's not like i am creating these thoughts or it's not like uh, you know um, there is a conscious effort to do these things uh, but automatically this continues and uh, it's not taking me anywhere it, it doesn't take anywhere anybody anywhere it's just like running in circles and another interesting thing is these thoughts and emotions are very very impermanent right so you know it's it's, it's interesting i i was talking to one of my friends and um, she said something which triggers us very strong emotions and thought inside me right now the interesting thing is that thought and emotion has gone away right and there is uh, no solution that can come up uh, i mean there is no way i can eradicate that emotion right so there is no way i can change my past experience by doesn't matter how much i think right and that experience has gone away already right that uh, combination has gone away already so it's like senseless process right it's senseless process unless i really intelligently want to work on that uh, it's just senseless to try to you know <laughs> to try to uh, use the intelligence to uh, the use the intellectual mind to make sure that something that happened in the past didn't happen right or you just change it somehow so uh, it's kind of stupid actually <laughs> but it's weird how this uh, internal state of minds are actually working and uh, yeah yeah <laughs> that's why I, I thought i should share it <laughs>